Hi, welcome to vvvolleyball.com. Today we're gonna to be reviewing some knee pads, and I'm pretty excited I'm here to review the A6 Gel. Conform knee pad, I believe it's called. Yeah. The A6 Gel Conform knee pad. So uh, this knee pad's a little bit different because it's got a gel interior, <coughs> excuse me, versus right. uh, like a padding, is that correct? Exactly, yeah, it has a gel cushioning system. Um, it's almost, to me, it looks like it's made in a four leaf clover type of shape so you have <laughs> and it's main, big isn't it Look it is big, big. It's, it's full coverage of the knee which is nice i mean you feel like every part of your kneecap and the areas surrounding the kneecap are covered and versus foam it's you know foam padding or any other type so this of is if you've got a kid that like falls on his knees or is kind of uncoordinated <laughs> yeah. if you got one of those kids this might yeah. be the one for you <laughs> Libero, you know, somebody that's well, the libraries are generally like semi-coordinated. So if you're true. a parent that can admit that your kid's not got a lot of... <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> that's a good point. Or they'll be digging a lot of balls, so they will oh, be yes, in the ground. Oh, yes, well, we can say it like that. But yeah, it definitely... I mean, the one thing about uh, gel cushioning versus foam is gel is not going to de degrade over time. As uh -huh. far as when you're hitting the ground, the cushion that comes from it, it'll so always it's have gonna some last sort of a little cushion. longer. Last a little longer. It might not dissipate the heat as much as foam would, so you could, you know, sweat a little bit more. It's a little hotter overall. Okay, let's pass some balls. Tell me what you think. You're passing good, like usual. <laughs> so that's good. You want to go down on the knee yeah. and get a feel? Oh, I like it. It doesn't move at all. Really? really yeah, they really stay in place. Um, yeah, some of the others I was noticing, they're riding down. Those, those stayed in place. Uh, you know, they're not as breathe it's not as breathable as some other knee pads. They do have this Lovely little peephole. I didn't like that peephole. I kind of feel like it squishes your skin through a little bit. Yeah, I didn't like that. Uh. But I feel that they might have done that to create a little more breathability in there because it is a full coverage knee pad. Sure. Um, it's That's super a good point, flexible though. though. They, I think the way they wrap this around the kneecap, I feel like I can move any which way. Okay, let's rate them. Shouldn't people are getting tired of us. Breathability. We could talk for hours. I know. We like to talk. Uh, three and a half. Okay, that's a good one. That's because of the gel. Yep. Support. Five. It feels amazing. Okay, flexibility. I'd say four and a half. It's it's very flexible. Cushion. Five. You must give it's it a awesome. five. Yeah. Fit. I like the fit. It's a at lengthwise. It's good. Um, feels very secure on my knee. It and it wasn't move. moving a lot. It was yeah. Not moving a lot when I dive. Overall rating. I like uh, four. Maybe just the breathability. Yeah. yeah. So, okay, pretty good knee pad, uh, especially if you are going to be falling a lot on your knees. And I know it is a moisture management, so they make up for the fact that it might not breathe as well, so that's good. That's what they say. That's what they say. Okay, <laughs> well, we can test it. Uh, so, if you have more uh, questions about these knee pads or looking for reviews on other volleyball knee pads, go to vbvolleyball.com where we have product reviews by the best volleyball players and coaches in the world.